What's going on, Risco gang? Coming at y'all boys with another banger, boys. And today, we have our first offensive line build in ESG Football 24, boys. Yes, we are making a Trent Williams build today for y'all. Let's go hop into it. Now, really quick, huge shout out to the ESG team for giving me early access to the player builder too. Shout out to y'all boys once again. I cannot play online, cannot get any gameplay for y'all just yet, but we can hop into the player builder and test out everything here. So, once again, huge shout out to them. Also, if you guys don't know what ESG Football 24 is, it is a free to play simulation football game. It's gonna have 7v7 and 11 versus 11, no AIs. And this game will have an open world free roam so that you can walk around in along with this being available just for next gen consoles and PC at launch. So things like the next gen Xbox and the PlayStation 5, it will be available at launch on these consoles along with PC. For the older gen, you know, the, the current gen guys, you know, just like the PS4 and stuff, it will be available on those consoles but at a later date. So keep that in mind. And one last thing, boys, I always have to make sure I say is every single video, make sure you guys watch my previous videos, boys. I be still getting questions about a bunch of stuff that we already talked about with this game, such as is it gonna be pay to win? You know, how you how you know can you, can you body your upgrades on your players? Everything in the book we have literally talked about with this game. So make sure you guys make sure you guys watch those previous videos and come back to this one. Cause I'm telling you right now, we covered a lot of information about this ESG football game. Now let's we'll get into the Trent Williams build, boys. So y'all see on y'all screen, Trent Williams number 71. Yes, it is going down today, bro. Almost everybody and their mama has been asking me to do an offensive lineman build because this is one of the first times, probably the first time we've been able to make a offensive line build in a game like this. So, hey, it's going down. And I'm, I'm not gonna lie, a lot of people are gonna be excited, you know, to kind of play old line because it's something different, something new that we haven't been able to do in a football game before. So, yes, it is going down today. Now, first things first, gotta talk about the height and the weight. So, height, we're gonna go with 6'5, 300, and then, yeah, the, the height's gonna be 6'5. I seen online, he was 6'5, and then height, and then weight, we're gonna go with 320 pounds. Now, they, they fluctuate with their weight a lot, these NFL linemen, but I seen uh, 320 on the internet the most, so we're gonna go with 320. So, 6'5, 320 pounds. Now, obviously, you'll see on your screen the um the avatar the player build he doesn't really change like his like his, his shape doesn't change but when the game does come out yes obviously your shape and your body will change as you have a bigger you know you know taller player yes your body and stuff will change this is that in the early access it doesn't change now let's get into the skill sets on this trent williams build so this is our first time doing the offensive lineman build and with trent williams he's one of the best if not the best tackles in the league right now the dude i think it's like a 99 or 98 in madden right now so the dude is absolutely absolutely insane so let's go ahead and make them right here so boom first things first gonna have to obviously do is gonna go ahead and get bulldozer out the way so obviously if you see on your screen all like the kind of like dark blue uh skill sets that means it's offensive lineman so you're gonna get bulldozer three times and now you will see his impact block and his run block go up to 97 run block bro that is insane he's gonna be knocking dudes out just pancaking dudes and you know just blocking the hell out of everybody on the field so 97 97 is really really good there now Obviously, on top of that, he's a really, really good pass blocker, too. He's very balanced on both sides, you know, uh, passing and running. So, obviously, we're going to give him Guardian. So, once again, Guardian is going to be the passing skill set. And now you will see, boom, he has 97 pass block also. So, across the board, he can do everything. He can pass block. He can run back, run block at a very, very high level. And that right there is going to make him insanely good on that O-line. That, that right there. That's all he needs. And that right there, that, that's it. Now, look at his strength. Also, he has 97 strength. We have not touched anything in the speedster stat but if you do you know touch up you know his bulldozer and his guardian that will boost his strength right there now with these last two skill sets realistically you could really do anything here but if you look at his speed I mean, look at his physical his speed is only at 47 that's kind of bad and we don't want him to be that slow so we're gonna give him one speedster now now you will see he has 64 speed now what you could do here also if you're making this build day one you can give him another speedster if you want to Get him up to 73 speed. That's if you want to. You don't have to, but if you want to, you could do that. Now, what I would probably recommend is, what I would probably say is give him some some, line, some, some lame stuffer or a bull rusher. Give him some stuff for a defense because this last stat right here doesn't make too much of a difference for this build because once again, he's going to be on the, uh, on the old line or D line when he plays on defense. So, if I was making this build, I would say go either bull rusher or lane stuffer. But, you know, to make this a true Trent Williams build, we're going to go uh, speedster here to make him 70, 73 speed. I want to say in Madden, he's like 72, 71. I'm not sure how fast he is in Madden, but I know he's in the 70s. So, right here, this is a true Trent Williams build. Like I said, though, making this build day one, 
Keep in mind, you have to play both sides of the ball. I would probably say give him lane stuff, and you'll see his block shed goes up, his run stopping goes up. So when you get on defense, you're you're at D tackle. You're at least you know shedding and doing something on the D line. But once again. To, for, for a true Trent Williams build, this is it right here. You see 73 speed. And like I said, 97 blocking across the board, which is insane. So now, boys, we hopping into the badges. And I already know a couple of guys are going to ask me in the comments who would want to be a lineman. That's just something that I've seen a lot of people um, ask in the comments. We're going to talk about that in just a second. But let's get through his badges really quick. So his badges, you will see his blocking badges are insane, bro. With him having 97 across the board, he basically gets everything GOAT tier. Literally everything. He got 42 available upgrades here. So we can go basically go everything here except for lumberjack so he'll get block aid which will basically have with the office of lineman uh pass blocking rating impact block will boost right here um this will boost the entire offensive line's run blocking rating um this this set increases beast vulnerability at a higher rate after performing a highlight play don't know exactly what that means but this one glue trap increases run blocking rating this one increases the strength when, uh, when run blocking and this one increases the pass blocking rating against defenders uh that performing the ball rush move so really across the board here he gets an extra boost everywhere here. Literally an extra boost. He gets plus six to basically all of his blocking stats. So instead of him only having 97 impact, 97 pass block, he now has 103 pass block, 103 run block, 103 impact block, which is once again insane. Next thing we're going to talk about is going to be he, get, he gets some engaging stuff here. So this is some stuff for defense. He gets a little boost to his block shed. He gets a, gets a boost to um strength when, uh you know, stop, when trying to, you know, uh, stop the run right here. So he gets a couple things here, but nothing too crazy. Now, physical is where he gets actually a couple of things also he does get muscle on go so that's gonna boost his strength by six so instead of him only having 97 strength he will not have 103 strength which is bro he's gonna be just knocking dudes out just throwing dudes tossing dudes that is insane so 103 strength for him then he gets afterburner cheetah energized and quick strength all on go but with him having afterburner on go and cheetah on go his speed and excel will now go to 73 so honestly that's pretty fast for an offensive lineman that's pretty fast and he's gonna be able to pull or do whatever he has to do on the o-line to get to that next level and get those blocks so that's pretty good now also he does get some tackling badges right here he gets hall of fame halt he gets uh force field uh, on hall of fame and he gets secure tackler gold and wrangler on bronze so he does get once again a couple defensive badges but nothing too crazy because once again we did not touch any of his defensive stats and overall those are the badges for this trent williams build and honestly once again this build looks insane and that right there is the trent williams build boys a three times bulldozer which makes him supreme a supreme guardian and a two times speedster so that makes him a pure speedster so this is the trent williams build right here um hey he, he's gonna be a beast bro now, I wonder I wanted to answer this question because some of y'all were asking, you know, what well, what happens if you don't have enough old line? What if you don't have enough, you know, teammates who want to be on the old line doing the dirty work, doing the trench work? All they will do is just put a, a CPU on your team. That's all they will do. They're not going to stop people. And, you know, they're, they're not going to say, oh, you can't play because you don't have enough, you know, old linemen that, you know, want to use her, whatever the case is. No, they're just going to put CPUs on your team and you will still be able to play. Now, we don't know exactly, like, how many you need to, like, get in the game. We don't know that yet, but they did tell me that, if there, if there was a situation where, you know, a team doesn't have enough users for an old line, or they, just, they don't have enough users for a 77, or whatever the case is, you'll just get filled up with, with CPUs. Now, obviously, you don't want that, though, right? Because, one, you can't communicate with the, you know, with the offensive linemen if they're CPUs, and they're going to also play a little bit worse when they're CPUs. The, 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 the CPUs in this game are not going to be OP unless, you know, it's something like a Randy Moss or something like a Legend CPU, which is, they, they already said it's going to be pretty, like, it's not, it's not going to be a, 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 a common thing. Thing, right it's not gonna be common where you have a 99 cpu on your team that's not gonna be a common thing it's not gonna be a common thing where you have a 99 wide receiver that's a cpu that's not gonna be a common thing most of the time these cpus that get you know put on your team where you know you don't have enough teammates they're gonna be pretty bad so obviously there's gonna be an incentive to you know having a full team of, of real users but in the case where you know you're like dang we're down bad we don't have enough users you will still be able to play you're not gonna be like oh oh you're locked out of the game you're not able to play no they're still gonna let you get into a game just with CPUs on the team. They'll have CPUs on the old line if you need it. So yes, you will still be able to run and you'll still be able to play online if you don't have a full team. If you don't have a, you know everybody who has a position or whatever the case is, yes, you will still be able to play. But y'all let me know how y'all feel about it down below. Is this a true Trent Williams build? How many of y'all will be on the old line or the D line? Let me know down below. I need to know who's going to be in those trenches with your boys. Let me know down below in the comments. And that's it for the video, boys. Thank you guys for watching. Like, comment, and subscribe for more bangers just like this one. And until next time, peace.